Chef Tony Matassa, BarbecueGuys.com. I have my Fire Magic Echelon Diamond fired up. It's time for us to begin our grill test with hamburger and steak, and then we'll take it to the pizza test. I'll place the hamburgers out around the grill so we can get a good overall representation of Echelon's grilling evenness, followed by a couple of steaks over the e-burners, and I'll place one over the sear burner so we can check it out. It won't be long now. Now I'll turn the steaks 45 degrees to make nice crosshatch sear marks. Looks like it's time to flip the steaks. They're looking great so far. I'm getting hungry just from the smell. It's time to remove the steak from over the infrared burner and I'll turn the hamburgers. We're getting perfect flame kiss without any runaway fires. Now it's time for the steaks over the e-burners to come off. I'll come back in a minute to get the hamburgers. They look awesome. I'll bring them back to my table so that you can get a close-up look at everything. Here they are. The Fire Magic Echelon has grilled some excellent looking steaks and hamburgers. Everything off the Echelon is looking incredible so far. It's time for us to try out our low temperature pizza test. We'll just place it right here in the center. We'll let it grill for about 10 minutes. It's time to check it out. I'll bring you in for a close up. There you have it. The Echelon has performed great on the low temperature test as well. Thank you for watching. To learn more about the Fire Magic Echelon Grill, please follow our link or give us a call. Remember, here at barbecueguys.com, we smoke the competition.